Hello everyone. In this video, I want to show you how to uh, convert a, an unsigned uh, number into its binary representation. Uh, here in my example, I have a very large number, 3,456,789,123. And, uh, you know, using uh, a process that I'm going to explain briefly, I will get the 32-bit representation of the number. The idea is very simple. You just need to uh, keep dividing the number by two until you reach to zero. And then uh, keep track of both the quotient and uh, remainder of the division. So the, 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 the first row contains uh, the given number, three billion something. I calculate the uh, quotient and remainder of the number when it's divided by two, and I place it in cells B2 and C2. Then I copy cell B2 to uh, cell A3, and I do the same operation again in the next row. I basically calculate the quotient and remainder of the number when it's divided by two, and I keep doing this until I reach to zero as the quotient. And, uh, you know, this one has uh, 32 bits and um, it's kind of predictable because when you take the log of this huge number, 3.4 billion, uh, billion, when you take the log uh, base two, the number that you get uh, is uh, somewhere around 31 point some uh, value, which is, um, if, you wrap it, if you round this number up, you get 32. So the idea is you need to take the log base two and then round the number up to find out how many binary, how many bits you need to represent the number in binary. But that's not really important here. After you got all the remainders in column C, you need to reverse the order of column C and put it, I put, it, put the bits in column D and then I concatenate all the bits and I place it in uh, cell E2. So cell E2 contains uh, the binary representation of this large number. This Excel sheet, which is available on Canvas, can work, also work for smaller numbers, let's say 43. Uh, if you place 43 in cell A2, in cell E2, you will see the 32-bit representation of the number, which has a lot of zeros, leading zeros. And that's obvious because 43 only needs six bits. And then if you put 65,000, for example, then you have 16 bit representation followed by 16 leading zeros. This is gonna give you a 32 bit representation. That's it for this video.